money. One of the challenges of materialism, of loving money, is that it's usually an invisible sin. You're probably not going to have a fellow Christian walk up to you and say, you know, I'm worried about you loving money. There's usually not outward things that would show that. Now, if you're sinning to chase money, and if you're putting maybe money above godly things, maybe there's a few things that might lead people to to wonder if that's what's going on in your life. But it's usually something between me and God that I've let creep into my heart that no one else can see. And that's what's scary about it. Because it could just stay there and grow there and sit there and never get dealt with. My prayer this morning is that you and I will make sure that God helps us keep a spotlight on our relationship to money.